Hey everybody, welcome back to Pokemon XD Gale Darkness. Last episode, we beat this guy named Arog, or whatever his name is. And now, this part, we will attempt to defeat um, Snaddle and catch his Pokemon. Snaddle, I honestly believe, is tough, is way tougher than, um, What's her face? Fuck. I know I should have taken out Lantern first. Shockwave always has a 100% chance hitting. Oh, I, I gotta fix my camera. There we go, that's, a little, that's better. And sadly, Quacks are still hanging on. Oh, he's lowering he's low our speed, shit. Takedown on Lantern. Just so we get up to, like I said last episode, um, I was rudely interrupted by my mom. Dead. She rudely interrupted me. Rock Tomb, I know, I know, Vapor's gonna go down on this move, so, no, 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 take down, I'm gonna try to keep myself, I can have three hyper potions, I can keep myself alive, alright, my plan is to take out Lantern, because Lantern is gonna be the toughest one to take out, bar none, bar none, without that. It's sad that right now Sammy's the second fastest Pokemon on the field. Lantern's gonna go down next turn, so will Quagsire, so that's really a big plus. Yeah, so their main goal is to take out is to slow down Vapor, which is gonna be, like I said, it's gonna be their main priority. I won't be surprised if they use like a hyper potion on Lantern. Oh, they're using Water Gun on No! Oh, hey, you're hanging on. Nice. Way to go, Sammy. Oh, come on, do what you were born to do. You took out Lantern. Yes, you did it. Did it. Sammy's took one of that round right there. Lunatone. And Lunatone is, is, is Snaddle's only Shadow Pokemon. Again, again, this was a Pokemon I was really intending to use because, personally, I'm a big, big, big Lunaturn fan. I think Lunaturn is probably one of the coolest looking Pokemon, very rarely used by LPS, but he is really a cool looking Pokemon. Yeah, level 28. Cast form. What I'm going to try to do is, uh, I don't know if I should do this early, but uh, I'll use this on cast one, I'll use the word on Lunatone, Shadow Sky, and Shadow, this is a cool looking move I guess. Okay, I'm almost fine by that, I knew that was going to happen, so I'm alright with it. Alright. Let's send out Bolt because Cast Form can turn into a water type and screw Creed out. Alright, not bad. Let me see, this comes down from the sky. It doesn't really do much, but it's really annoying because it takes out like. A buttload of Pokemon. Thunder Wave on Lunatown. And Ice Gun on Cast One. This should really help out. Plus I have an Ultra Ball I could possibly use on Lunatown. To higher my chances of catching it. And nice! Lunatown was sort of slow slower. Slowing down a little bit. 
And Vapor's still hanging on! Nice! Stupendous! Whoa! And Bulb was hit! Cast one was hit! 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 And Vapor was hit! Alright. Bulb use Spark on Cast one, take out Cast one. And I will use an Ultra Ball on Lunatown. Because it's, paral it's paralyzed and it's in the yellow, so I don't know. I already know Cast one's down. I don't intend to see myself catch this on, this on my first try. One. Two, three. Shock to call it Lunatone, but okay, I'm fine with that. And we're gonna sound Matang. Spark down goes. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna try to keep Vapor alive because. Oh. And Vapor is like the only one who can really take out Matang. I guess. I'll, I'll store Energy power lowers you of your Pokemon liking you, so. I'm not gonna use it. I'll use Ice Cream on Matang. Thunder Punch! Oh my god! I can't believe the way I reacted. I was, like, I was like, Thunder Punch! Oh my god! <laughs> and it didn't do much. It did like, what, 35 damage? Oh my god. <laughs> Spark. Can I only use. Fight. Oh my god. My reaction was just fantastic. I was like, oh my god! Thunder Punch! Maybe paralyzed, maybe on a little move. Confusion. Okay. Not really much. And this battle man only lost one Pokemon. That's really good, I guess. And chomp. Down goes Matang. We beat Snaddle. And we caught Snaddle's Lutone. Not a bad battle at all. Except so for Evan Snaddle. Ah, uh, no! He doesn't need to put off. He's just still staying there. How is this possible? I've never seen a child so strong. But no matter, surely I've bought Gor Gorgon enough time. His precious recovery operation must be finished by now. Today we will leave quietly, but don't you forget us. And there's something glowing over there. Thank you! We kept from we kept them from taking our videotapes. We've got some explosive footage. My name's Marcia. We were gathering news in Fennec when Cypher called us and brought us here. But there's a silver lining in this. We managed to capture your heroics on tape. We did it, didn't we? <laughs> yeah, you bet we bet I did. Okay, we need to rush back to Pyre and get this news out on the air as soon as possible. Let's meet again. Thank you for everything. There's something glowing over there. Marcia, wait for me! And... <gasps> shiny! There's something on the floor! And there's something weird. There's something glowing on the floor. It's like it's like a small wall you can like, go through. And there's the elevator key. Let's use the elevator key. This honestly was not a tough battle. Um, since I'm out of my Pokemon, I'm gonna put Vapor in the back. Because uh, Vapor is like the. Vapor's the highest level Pokemon. And I don't believe there's any more trainers, but in case there is. Oh yeah, I cleared out the whole entire trainer stuff over here. Thing with Bobber, okay. Yes. Yes, I'd like to take a rest on the bed, please.
Thank you. You can get back here anytime if you want. It's just, just so good. All right. So we will go in there, but not quite yet, because there's an item over here that I've been meaning to get. Swine up is now able to purif purify now. And what's over here? Three ounce of balls. Well, like, wow. Just wow. Again, costume there would be like a rich boy right here, but there's no rich boys. Just a little boy. Let's hurry up. Elevator key. The elevator could have to be responding. But guess what? We have a key. And elevator key. Can that be you? Oh, 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 oh. Silly me. Can you go over here? Yes, yeah, she's elevator key. Start and give it a twist. There we go. Oops. Fail by me. Anyway, let's go in here. Whoa, there's a woman there. There's people here. I'm Fennec Mayor Trust. Who who are you? How, how did you get here? Michael explain that happened to the mayor. Oh my, so you, Michael, sent that scoundrel snaddle packing. That is quite amazing. Does that mean you, we can finally leave this miserable place? Everyone, I need your attention, please. Let us all thank Michael heartily, then get out of here. Michael, I thank you sincerely. I see. So we were close to having Cypher replaced all our citizens with their members. Oh, what a heinous plot, but it was stopped and we owe it all to you, Michael. On behalf of the whole city, I sincerely thank you. In fact, I can't thank you enough right now. If you could please visit me at my home later. Michael, right? Your actions saved the city. We all owe you a big thanks. I'd like to keep in touch. May I get your PDA number? I'll give you a call if anything comes up. Can you guess the PDA number? Thank you, I'll be in touch. I've been thinking, I think Fennec was targeted because Cypher wanted to, wanted to quash rumors that were spreading in town. People in the city have seen shady characters coming and going in the desert. People were talking about it. Oh, according to what the people say, there's something in the desert around here. Maybe we'll go visit soon. You should ask around for details from the people in the city. Oh, look, people. I came from Iggy to take my granddaughter home, but just as I got to Fennec, I was caught up in the in toilet for it. Thank you so much. We can finally return to Iggy. I was going to visit Iggy with my grandma, but then those people came and locked us up. I'm going to run a daycare just like my grandma when I grow up. Thank you, Michael. If you visit Iggy, please come to the daycare. Okay, maybe we will. Maybe we will. But I think we should go talk to the mayor really quickly. Hope it's not. And you see, the music becomes happier now. Yay! Hello, Michael. So good of you to come. Our city was saved by your selfless actions. I sincerely thank you. This is a mere token of my appreciation. Please accept it. The EXP share. Nice. I must say, you saved us in our darkest hour. Justy couldn't do a thing knowing that we were being held hostage. Honestly, if you hadn't arrived, I shudder to think what could have happened Conversity. So yeah, guys, we beat Snaddle, we saved Fennec, and I'll just talk about the XP share. Um, XP share, you can put a Pokemon in your party, and if you want, to, if you like, get experience. Uh, the Pokemon who is holding the XP share gets the um, experience from the battle. So yeah, <laughs> this guy's pretty funny. They say you saved the town, Darkest Hour. Like, give me a great pleasure. Oh uh, no, oh, that's too bad. It's funny because if he says, oh, he's in my fake, huh? And that guy is Captain chasing after you after him just like in concert. But yeah guys, in this part, we beat Snaddle, we saved Fennec. So I think that's enough for this video. So if you guys like this video, subscribe and comment. I'll see you guys later in XDL Darkness.